free. Cream too. I know, free is good. Free for the kiddos. Take advantage of that. Not free ice cream, free admission. Right, right. Yeah. Exactly. <laughs> you have to work for your ice cream. You have to work for your ice cream. <laughs> uh, well, can you? do you have to work for the potatoes and the corn this year? I don't know. Poco Festival is up and running in North Bramford today, and we sent Marcy Jones there. Yeah, she's over there live searching for potatoes and corn. <laughs> Marcy, have you found any of the namesake vegetables yet? Oh, I sure have. I absolutely have. Before uh, we get to my interview, you guys, what do you call a very zen spud? A zen oh. spud. Um, a rustic potato? Hmm. <laughs> Cute and creative, but a meditator! I'm... <laughs> something for everyone even if you're not a carnivore like myself i am here with elisa tell us about the poco festival 21 years this is amazing this is amazing yep it's it's evolved from a one-day event to a three-day event we have a tremendous amount of food here for yep. the weekend no charge to get in paid parking or free shuttles you have okay. the option on either end of town and you guys are so hard working because you put this on, you have the support of the town, but financially you guys are on your own here. It doesn't come together without all the volunteers putting their, their blood, sweat, and tears in here. So behind us we have NBFD, the fried dough, of yeah. course, pizza, incredible. You can't not have fried pizza. You can't it's come wonderful. here. Is it even a festival if you don't have these guys exactly. here? And then let's talk about Art's Delicious French Fries because I think they've been here for a while, They've right? been us since we, we went, since we went three days. Arts has been here or with us uh, for the whole time. Okay. They've stuck with us, and they do great French fries and the curly fries. Unfortunately, the owner had passed away last year. Aww. Great guy. But the legacy Kevin lives on. The legacy lives on. I love so that. it's great to have them back. And for anybody who's never visited in the 21 years, first of all, what have you been doing? Second of all, it's expanded even if you have come before. So we've got more rides, more food than ever. We're taking up more space, which is great. More to walk around, more for everybody. Let's talk a little bit about some of the different events that you can do here. I know that we have fireworks We have an up. amazing fireworks show, best in the state, 9 o'clock tomorrow night. Uh, come on down. They are awesome. It is a great venue to see them, and it's going to be beautiful weather tomorrow night. And you have a little tip on where to watch, right? Oh, absolutely. You watch from the amphitheater over here and uh, down next to our potato so corn It's booth. kind of naturally hilly, so naturally. you have a good They're right above point. your head. Right Fantastic. above your head. Fantastic. Any other tips for somebody who's going to come on down visit you starting either tonight or going into this weekend? What should you wear? What should you plan for? Dress comfortably. It's a lot of walking. You have a lot of rides, a lot of area to cover. Make sure you eat a potato and a corn from our potato corn booth. Yes! <laughs> we have to give a shout out to the main stars of it. Speaking of another star, we've got Rose over here. Hey, girl. Hey, how are you? Fantastic. You wanted to say a little something about your sponsors because there are so many fine folks that help you put this on. Yes, we would not be able to do this if we did not have our sponsors. And a lot of our sponsors are local businesses. Mm -hmm. um, we have Maizano Brothers, Palumbo, Trucking, we have VP Electric, Samson Electric, um, of course all of our farmers that are donating corn for us here, the two uh, wineries in town have um, given us great pricing on their I love wine. how it's such a community oriented We, we want to get the community involved and keep it a community event. Iconic. Um, if anybody is still corn fused after watching this, where can they get the information? They can get it on the website, NorthBranfordPocoFestival.com. I love it. Ladies, are you going to be here greeting everybody tonight? We will be here greeting everybody. We will be here all weekend. Oh, who's this guy? Do we know him? No. no. <laughs> Hi, sir. Are you excited for the festival tonight? Oh, we're looking for, oh, Mary's over there. She's shaking someone down. Yeah, you'll you'll know who it is. <laughs> All right, guys, come on down. Poco Fest starts tonight. What time? Five o'clock. Five o'clock. We love it here. We're never leaving. All right, well, since this is a family show, Marcy, I got a joke for you. What do you call buying a yes. huge amount of corn all at once? A Saturday night for me. <laughs> I don't know what. A stock investment. Oh, terrible. <gasps> Thank you, Marcy. Way to go, Nicole. Love Ooh, it. Thank oh, you, Adam. Bye, Marcy. See you in a little bit. I tried. <laughs>